Chinese warship Huang Shan docked in Darwin for the first time, ready to join Australia's war games after months of tensions on the high seas. When you're operating the high seas, it's not like operating someone's country. Building that confidence together so when we do cross paths, we have an understanding and a trust and an and and ability to work together. Exercise Kakadu aims to forge stronger ties with some of our closest neighbours. The Chinese Navy has taken part before, but only as an observer. We certainly want to promote a positive defence relationship with, with China. It's in our interest, and I think this is the next step towards it. Held every two years, it's one of the biggest maritime drills of its kind. More than 3,000 personnel from 27 countries will work together, sharing battle tactics on our seas. We've got very small countries, uh, such as Cook Islands, uh, operating with uh, superpowers in the US, our allies. It's our silver anniversary. Uh, we started 25 years ago. We're with only five, uh, five countries participating. The War Games wrap up on September 15. Louise Rennie, Nine News.